to start talking to each other in Navajo code. <laughs> no, <laughs> no one will understand what in the world you're talking about. At 94 years old, Peter McDonald is the youngest of only three Navajo code talkers alive today. He told a group gathered at Mayo Clinic in Phoenix, Arizona, how the Navajo language was used to create an unbreakable secret code used by the U.S. during World War II. The enemy never understood it, he said. We don't understand it either. <laughs> but it works. Send us some more Navajos. In addition to preserving the rich history of the Code Talkers, today McDonald is also working to help increase access to high-quality health care for indigenous communities. A lot of illnesses are never heard, like diabetes is this high as opposed to what's in the country that's this this low. Selena Thomas was born and raised on the Navajo Reservation. She now works for Mayo Clinic in a new program aimed at helping connect patients in indigenous communities with life-saving organ transplants. It feels like home. You know, it feels like, you know, I'm talking to my mom or my grandma. That's, that's Thomas and McDonald from different generations today unified in their mission. For the Mayo Clinic News Network, I'm Marty Velasco-Hames.